you a longtime user of RAM Steel, but have just used it to design gravity steel framing and would like to get more value out of RAM? Then this video is for you. In the next couple of minutes, we'll show how you can use your RAM Steel model for lateral analysis using some of the other modules and features in RAM Structural System. By the end of this video, you'll see how to calculate periods and modes of vibration for the building, centers of mass and rigidity at floor levels, and how to export this and other information from RAM Structural System into Excel. The first thing we need to do to use a RAM Steel model for seismic and wind analysis is specify the lateral resisting frames in the model. To do this, we change the framing property of the elements from gravity, their default, to lateral. In our case, we'll specify three braced frame cores, one at each end of the building and one in the center. This is then repeated for all floor layouts in the building. Next, we'll create the braces. To do this, select the elevation view icon and then select the beam within the first frame you want to create. There are a number of brace creation methods depending on what brace configuration you'd like to use. Once the members are placed, choose a size for each brace using the Assign Brace Size command. If sizes haven't been assigned for beams or columns, use the corresponding commands to choose sizes for those members also. The framing assignments can be visually checked by going to the 3D model view and turning off all gravity members, leaving only the braced frames. With the necessary modeling complete, we can move over to the RAM frame module, where all lateral analysis and element design is done. Using the Masses dialog under the Loads menu, we can review the story masses, centers of mass, and seismic eccentricities. The centers of rigidity at each floor level and the modes of vibration can be calculated by creating load cases for each of these. After they are added, simply analyze the structure and make sure to toggle on the Write Results to Data Extractor option so we can use the results in a spreadsheet in the next step. Toggle on the center of mass and center of rigidity displays to review the locations at each level in 3D. You can limit the display to a single level at a time to make it easier. Similarly, the modes of vibration can be reviewed on screen by turning on the modes display. Choose the mode you'd like to review, set a scale factor, and toggle on the animation if desired. Note that the view perspective can be changed dynamically while the animation is playing. Select Apply at the bottom of the dialog to make any setting changes active. Now let's export our results to Excel so we can use them in our larger calculation set. To do this, we go to the main screen of RAM Structural System, also known as RAM Manager, and use the Extract Data command under the Post Processing menu. In the dialog that appears, we simply choose which properties and quantities we want to include in our spreadsheet or database. Any arrangement of data we create can be saved as a template for further use. If you found this video helpful, be sure to check out more detailed versions of this content on the Bentley Learn server.